Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you have decided to start organizing your files and creating new folders, you will want to move files or folders around or copy them to a new location. There is a difference between moving and copying. When you move a file or folder, you place the item in a completely different location on your computer. When you copy a file or folder, you make an exact copy of an item and then place the copy into a new place on your computer. When you move a file, it is often referred to as cutting and pasting. When you copy a file, it is referred to as copying and pasting. You can cut or copy and then paste files in several different ways. One way to do it is to navigate to the file or folder that you want to cut or copy so that you can see the items icon within the window. Make sure that you change the window size to restore so that you can see around the window if needed. Next, open a second window and navigate to the folder where you want to paste the item from the first window. Once again, you may need to resize the window in the restore size and lay the two windows next to each other. Then you can simply click on the file or folder from the first window and drag it into the second window and drop it. If the two files are located on the same drive, doing this will cut and paste or move the item. If they are located on different drives in your computer, it will copy and paste the item. Note that if you wanted to copy the item regardless, then simply hold down the control key on your keyboard as you are dragging and dropping the item between the folders. That will actually create a small plus sign next to your mouse pointer as you are dragging the item. This lets you know that the item is being copied versus moved or cut. Another way to cut, copy, and paste is to click on the item in any window that you want to cut or copy in order to select it. Then click the Organize button and choose either the Cut or Copy command as desired. Navigate to the folder where you want to paste the item that you just cut or copied. You may use the same window if desired. Once you're there, Simply click the Organize button, and this time choose the Paste command to paste the item into the current window. One last way to cut, copy, and paste is by using the keyboard. To do this, highlight the object that you want to copy, and then press Ctrl C if you want to copy the object, or press Ctrl X on your keyboard if you want to cut the object. To then paste the object that you cut or copied into a selected folder, open the folder and press Ctrl V on your keyboard to paste it. The paste command works the same to paste objects that are cut or copied. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.